today I'm making a work of art inspired by a geode. Geode is a hollow rock with an inside layer of sparkling crystals. The first thing I'm going to do is write my name on my paper with my black crayon. And then when I'm done writing my name, I'm going to draw a big imperfect oval on my paper. And remember to make it big, fill up your whole paper with this imperfect oval. Next, I'm going to draw another imperfect oval around or inside this one, just to make the line thicker, because this is the outer layer of our geode. This is the plain old rock part. So I'm just gonna color that in with the black. Next, I'm going to choose one marker, one watercolor crayon, and one oil pastel in a color scheme that I like. And a color scheme is a group of colors that look really nice together. I'm also going to grab a metallic sharpie because that's just fun. I'm going to use these drawing materials to draw the inner layer of sparkly crystals inside a geode. So I'm using them to draw more imperfect ovals inside my big imperfect oval. And they're gonna get smaller and smaller as I go towards the middle. Draw them nice and close together so that your geode has lots of beautiful colors inside of it. You don't have to go in a specific pattern with your drawing materials, but you certainly can. I'm gonna make the last ring on the inside a little jagged, cause that looks like a real geode, kind of broken on the inside like that. All right, well, I'm done drawing my layers, but I'm not quite done with my artwork yet because I'm going to take a cup of water and a paintbrush, and I'm going to gently paint around the inside of the geode. And that will turn my marker and my watercolor crayon into watercolor paint. And that'll just create uh, more color and more color blending and make the inside of our geode look even more beautiful. When you pick your color scheme, think about colors that will mix well together and not just make a muddy color so that your geode stays bright and beautiful.